And welcome back, everyone, to Let's Play Fatal Frame 3. Let's actually leave this room. It's neat to see she has slippers on. Oh, the bright colored roll down shade hangs on the window. Uh, Muki picked it out and bought it for us the other day. Wow, she seems to do everything for you. you nice mouth flapping there. It's like Godzilla. Good morning, Ray. Continue mouth flaps. This is a Muko's room, even if this is my house, I don't really like to go into her room without permission. I know Muki wouldn't care if I did though. Or at all though. What's this room? Use room. Ever since the accident I try not to come down come in here unless I have a good reason. Well, how about because I want to see what's in there? Alright, let's just continue running around. I wonder oh I should look at those photos we took of this scary woman. Ah. It's too close. Alright, let's get rid of some of these photos. I'm kind of running out of space. Delete that one. Let's delete anything that's under... We've already seen all these, so I'm just gonna... You know what? That one's kind of creepy, so I'm gonna keep that one. I'll delete that one. I'm gonna delete that one. Might as well. You're only worth 200, so I'll delete that one. I'm only gonna keep the really interesting ones. Like, not that one. That one's not interesting to me. Uh, what's this one? Second floor woman. I'll delete that one, just because. Uh, impaled girl, I'll keep. Last woman. Oh, I'll keep the rest of these. And I'm just gonna hit, where is it? Uh, menu. And just sort by time. Just because we can. These will all go away anyways, once I, uh... Once I, uh, save the game and leave. It'll all just be deleted anyway, so it doesn't really matter. Alright. Good morning, Ray. Uh, it looks like it's going to rain all day today again. Like, blah, all day today, too. You don't have to work so much this week, so why don't you try to relax? Ray, you've been working too much lately. You were... woken up by a bad dream this morning. Not to mention what happened when we were out collecting data the other day. Anyways, let's try to take it easy today. That reminds me. There was a letter. It's addressed to you. Here, have some more stressfulness in your life. Sorry for not writing you... Okay, dear you, sorry for not writing you for so long. How are things with your fiancé? I'm continuing my investigation to Urban Legends. Which Urban Legend? Is it Pop Rocks and Coca-Cola? Looking like I thought, my niece... My niece's symptoms bear many similarities to the strange disease associated with the Urban Legend. I think mostly the story... I think most of the story is groundless rumor. But I've never heard there was a psychokinetic study done. Yeah, I'm going to say psychokinetic. If you have it, I'd like to see it. Maybe it will provide a clue. I'll take a break from, my wor from all my work, from all my other work, to devote myself to studying the urban legend. I like, I'd like your help. According to the documents, I've studied the, that camera I sent you. Okay, according to the documents, I've studied... That camera I sent you apparently is a rare camera obscure. Huh. Um, given where I found it, it may have some connection to the missing people and the urban legend. If you hear anything, please tell me. Regards. Kai, uh, Mara, I can't read that Japanese, but they have Japanese names. Interesting. Letter from, Kier, from K1. I'm going to call him K. Add to the file. It's from K. I just know that. I just read that. He wrote several times before. Have you still not told him about you? Nah, I just want to keep him in the dark. Camera obscure. I wonder if that would... Bleh, I wonder if it would be in you's room. K. Alright, let's look at our notes and look who up K is. Because I do not know. K. I've never met him personally, but he was a friend of you. He used to write from time to time. You seems to have known lots of people, both professionally and privately. According to the letter, he and you were doing research into urban legends. Maybe the camera obscure was somehow connected with that. I should tell him about the accident. Yes, you should. And I see a phone over here, so let's call him up right now and tell him. Just call him up. You, you gonna call him? No, I didn't think so. Watch this. If you look really closely, you can see the, the curtains move right here. It's kind of cool. All right. Uh, outside the window is a small garden, a light... Drizzle has been falling for several days now. Several days. Uh-oh. 
It's been some time since I last tended the garden. You don't do very much, do you? Uh, we decided against having a TV in, in our rooms and bought a big, a bigger one for the living room instead. I hardly watch it all these days. There's some cat food here. And the plan looks like looking after me as her jo as uh, Muko's job. Come to think of it, Muko looks after just about everything in the house these days. Yes, because you were lazy. You were lazy and do nothing. I turn the lamp on. No. There's a kitchen here. Let's go in the kitchen. Is anything cool in the kitchen? No, it's just a bunch of stuff. So let's continue elsewhere. Let's go to use room. And get that camera obscure. I thought we had the camera obscure already. Oops, I meant to go under uh, tools. Wow, we didn't take it from our dream. Look at that. We didn't take anything from our dream except for photos. Which, I don't know how that came back to us, but... What you looking at? I mean, not you, but um, Miku. Maiko. Whatever her name is. Alright, so let's go down here. Into the dreaded room. This is so there blah. There was something about some sort of camera obscure that you owned that you owned written in that letter. The camera obscure. Could it be the same camera I saw in my dream? Possibly. You know, I doubt there's that many. And we see a ghost. No, no ghost yet. I don't think. Huh. You'd think his parents would want some of his stuff, you know, for, you know, to remember their son by, but maybe not. Maybe he has no parents. Boxes. I leave everything out. There's not a letter there. Ray, may I help you with something? Oh, I just wanted to ask you. No, you didn't. You just want to take the camera. Ghosts. Or delusions, one of the two. Yeah, it's kind of sad. Is the rain? I'll do my crying in the rain. Wow, some light in the room now. We can see. It looks more than a light drizzle to me. Yeah. You know, for a really bad accident, you didn't get hurt at all. Huh. Oh, she calls the client. Blinds again. A thin ray of light... Uh, blah, a thin ray of sunlight comes in through the drawn curtains. It is always raining here. Whenever I hear the sound of rain... I can't help thinking back to what happened that day. There's some boxes here. Here are some car boxes in the corner of this room. After what happened, I tried to sort through his things. But after a while, I just couldn't go on anymore. And I haven't touched them since. A closet. And more boxes. Yeah, there's nothing in there. There's a, like another cabinet here. Used clothes are still hanging in this, inside the closet. I decided not to tidy them away. Once they were in boxes, I knew they'd never come out again. Uh, a bookshelf full of volumes of folklore, philosophy, and anthropology. Huh. Is it the books he wrote? They're all, they're all books you use for his work, or ones that were published by his company. There was a time when I used to be interested in them, but... It was only a passing phase. Oh, that's sad. Uh, there are typed and handwritten letters on the desk, along with several books. I have hardly touched any... I have hardly touched anything in here since that day. I just can't bring myself to tidy anything away. There's a notebook left out on top of the desk. Perhaps someone was in the middle of... Perhaps someone, wouldn't be you, was in the middle of working. So I'm going to steal the notebook. Uh, many of the urban legends classified as lost villages are modeled on real incidents, such as villages, since as a village was ruined when one villager massacred the others. Huh. They were often in a lime. 
something of well-known actual instances, legends, or oral tradition. All right, I'm going to pause the game here for a moment. Well, I'll actually leave it here, but when we continue, I'll continue reading this. Until then, until then.